Changing the subject of formula. Now this is quite a complex topic, um, but I'm just going to run through some basic skills here to help you. Um, to change the subject of the formula, or make x the subject of these formulas, I need to get it so that x equals at the end. And on the other side there must be everything but no x's. And there's no nothing with the x on this side. So I'm going to manipulate it using my usual rules of solving equations to get everything to the other side apart from the x. So to start with, in this one, I'm going to add the 4. So I end up with t plus 4 equals 2x. 2 times x, I undo 2 times x by dividing by 2. So I end up with, if I divide that by 2 and this by 2, I end up with x equals t plus 4 over 2. So that would be my new formula to find x. Then if I look at this one, I've got a square root here. This should go all the way across the top here. Um, to undo a square root, I need to square. So my first step would be to square both sides. If I square this side, I get t squared. If I square this side, that gets rid of the square root. So I end up with everything that's under the square root. And then I can just move this u. I don't, I don't need the u in it next to the, the x. So I can just move it to the other side. Um, and that gives me... 4xp. Now I want to get x on its own, so I need to divide by the 4 and divide by the p. I can do that once, or I could do it separately, but it's quicker to divide by 4p on both sides. And that would cancel this 4 and cancel this p to leave me with the x on its own, and I just rewrite it as x equals t squared minus u over 4p. So it's all about just taking the steps to get x on its own. Um, essentially what we do is we move everything that's not around the x to the other side. So this 2u can go to the other side to become minus 2u, and then I've got 5x squared. And then anything I'm multiplying by, I divide by, so I've got uh, t minus 2u over 5, and that's equal to x squared. To find x I need to do the square root of both sides, and uh, that would cancel this, this squared with this square root to leave me with x equals the square root of t minus 2u over 5. Okay, now all those are just one step at a time. This type of equation looks fairly innocuous, but the problem with this is you've got x in two places, and we can't have that. We have to have x in one place. And the way to do that is to factorise the x out of the expression on the right-hand side. So how, what do I times x by to get ax? Well, that's a and times uh, x by to get bx is b. So I put a bracket there where I've taken the x outside and I've all I've got left is the ab here. And now I can just divide by that ab because this is x times a plus b. So if I divide by a plus b I can find x on its own. So x equals t over a plus b. Okay.